hello hello it is now saturday sunday evening i'm a little confused just got back home and i got way more stuff than i anticipated on getting and we have been gone since four o'clock and it's 7 53 but when i tell you we were supposed to go to a walmart close to here where i live but for whatever reason my mom got on i4 the wrong way so we ended up going to the walmart where i moved from where they all still live and i haven't been in that walmart since i moved here three months ago and when i tell you that they redid the entire inside of the walmart i didn't know where anything was i thought i would have been home over an hour ago but I didn't know where nothing was. I had to keep asking where this was, where that was. Like, they completely redid it. And it looks like the Walmart that I went to here last week. So I guess that's the look of the Walmarts now. And that's why they changed that one to look like how all the other ones look. Oh, man. I didn't know where anything was. So it took me way longer than I thought it was going to take. And I got more stuff than i anticipated getting i had a list but i did add a few things and my son he's gone now um he's going back to his dad's my mom just they just left i guess some of the stuff was falling out of the bags when he was getting it out of the trunk because i make one trip when i get up here i'm not going back down so he made three more trips he already know the routine <laughs> and that's why i wanted to make sure i got what i needed while i had him so that he can make those trips because it's hard going up three flights of stairs when you got groceries and you got to make more than one trip like and there's no elevator this grocery haul is going to be a little all over the place because there's stuff in the bags that were not in the bags that were in other bags so just bear with me i'm gonna get through this as fast as i can because i want to take a shower and i want to eat because i haven't eaten today i literally woke up at 12 30 stayed in bed until 1 30 sat down for about 30 minutes and then got ready this first bag because i felt like i needed a new let me show y'all really quick before hold on this is my iphone and i have an outer box case on it it's a clear glittery outer box case and i don't let me turn on this light so y'all can see better i don't know if this happens with anybody else when they get like these clear cases and i have the gold iphone i always get the gold one i'm, I'm a gold kind of gal gold apple watch stainless steel but like look at like this part like the gold rubs off on the inside of the case it, it almost tarnishes the inside of the case and i don't know if it's if it's like from like heat i don't know what but like you can see it there too and i just i hate how that looks like you can see it in certain spots all the way around and it's the gold from the phone doing that to the case that drives me crazy well, i felt like i needed a new case and i was going to get the apple one but when the girl was explaining it to me she was like it's really not going to protect your phone it's really just silicone and for it to be 50 dollars, you would think that it would be protection but you're really just paying for the apple brand of the case you're not paying for the case you're paying for the name so i was like i'm not going to pay for it and it's not going to protect my phone and walmart being walmart they didn't have very much and I didn't really want to get another clear one, but for now, it'll do until I get something better. I should have done what I planned on doing. And there's a T-Mobile store right down the road, like literally right down the road, right next to the nail salon where I get my nails done. I was going to go there today and get one. I'm still probably next month going to go there and get one. And they're really cheap and they're good cases. But I mean, this is a good case and it was only like $12. It's basically like walmart version of an outer box defender type case so it is this ihome velvo case and you can actually hear how hard it is like it says filmy so it's a pretty rugged case 
It has triple la three triple layer protection, military grade shock absorption. So I got this clear for now. And then whenever I get a new case, I always feel like I need some kind of pop socket on my case. And they didn't have very much this time. Normally Walmart has a pretty big range of pop sockets, but they didn't this time. I just got this one. I don't know if it's gonna pick up, but yeah. I just hate the glossy. I wish it was more of a matte, but whatever, it'll do. So I got that. And because y'all know I love to make my apartment smell good, I'm gonna hate to edit this part of this vlog. Six minutes already. Um, I have two different sizes of the spray out air fresheners throughout the apartment. I have one in here right here. Well, you can't see, but it's over there by the door. So it sprays out this way. And then I have one right there. So it sprays out into the living room. And the one right there, y'all can't see, right there, it holds this size. And they didn't have, but like two different scents in this one. And I'm trying to get like fall theme, fall scents, but they didn't. I think they have like a cinnamon one and I guess that will work but whatever I got this one and this is lavender and chamomile and it's a two pack so I got that and then I have three of the other side of the the glade ones but I already have um the pumpkin since that's not open it's a double pack like this one but I have one right there one in the laundry room and one in my son's closet because he likes to not wear socks with his shoes so his closet be stinking but I told him if he do that again I'm gonna sit his shoes outside and I told him for now on you gotta wear socks with your shoes son your feet have an odor so yeah I have one in his closet one right there by the door and one in the laundry room keeping the laundry room smelling good and they hold this size and this is cashmere woods and then i also have like a pumpkin spice one that's in a double pack like this also that's not open yet so i'm good as far as those go and hold on and then i have seven of the airwick plug-in scent things that let out throughout the apartment i have seven of those in different places throughout the entire apartment I got this brown sugar and vanilla brown sugar and vanilla this is not the one I meant to get I meant to get the other one whatever brown sugar and vanilla and it comes with five I always get the five have all of that to keep my apartment smelling good I'm running low on my leave-in conditioner I got some more of my Cantu I had a hard time finding this but some more of my Cantu leave-in conditioner. I needed some more Tylenol because I'm running low. So I got this bottle of 100 of the 500 milligram. Always gotta have Tylenol. I've been having a little trouble sleeping this morning when I went to bed because I didn't go to bed until like four. That was the best sleep that I've gotten in three days. The two days before that with everything that's going on, I really didn't sleep those two days. Since I see that sleeping sometimes might be a task for me, I got this bottle of, it's the Walmart brand of the Unisum 100. It's 100 soft gel and they're 50 milligrams sleeping pills, Unisum. I used to buy sleeping pills all the time because I always just felt like, you know, when you have nights where you can't sleep, you should have sleeping pills. Um, I have two of these. The other one is in another bag somewhere. And this is the vapor inhaler for your nose. I love these. And they're only like $1.63. So I got two of these. Like I said, the other one is in another bag somewhere. I'll come across it. <laughs> I got some baby oil. I'm not going to say <laughs> why I got this. But let's just say when you have your adult moments, sometimes you might need some baby oil. And we're gonna leave that right there. We all grown here though, right? Right. Okay. Trying to keep it with, yep, see, shit's just falling out of the bag. Trying to keep it with the stuff that's not food first. So, needed some mouthwash. Got some mouthwash. Running low on that. I saw this online because I was gonna actually have my stuff delivered. 
but I wanted to go in the store and get the stuff. But this double pack of their body wash, and it was only $7. And normally, like, the big pump one is $7 for just one. So to get two for $7, yes, Alvino. Cannot beat that. And then because I've been here for three months, and my toilets are starting to look a little crazy, I got since I have two toilets but I mean two pack I can't beat that I got some toilet cleaner and the brush and I wanted to get the big one but they didn't have the big one but I'm running low on my hair gel so I got some more hair gel and because you know I want to get back into using my my aroma therapy diffuser i got the pack of the oils like 15 dollars, and it comes with six comes with i've used some of these but i haven't used all of them i've used the breathe easy i think that's actually the only one that i've used out of these i've used other ones out of, from this brand but the only one that i've used in this one is the breathe easy but they also have the calming sleep which i'll definitely be using the relax relaxation immunity harmony and tranquil tranquility probably gonna do this tonight i have two of them so i'll probably have them in different rooms i'll have one in here and one in my bedroom let me see what else is there anything else that's not food this might be a vlog by itself i think this is going to be a vlog by itself also for the toilets and also just to clean other things always got to have comment yes and then here's my other nose inhaler and then some toothpaste colgate sparkling white i'm not going to pick up those big things but i got a two four six eight but i got a 12 pack of toilet paper and an eight pack of napkins is it eight two four six i think it's eight packs of napkins and a big thing of laundry detergent and a thing of bleach so that is all of the non-food and now i'm gonna do the food part yeah, this is definitely going to be a standalone vlog. I got two packs of this bacon, and this is already cooked because I don't feel like cooking bacon. This is the other one. I wasn't planning on getting turkey bacon or the other bacon, but when I got in the store, I said I wanted some bacon. So, turkey bacon. Probably going to cook this tonight. Going to make some nachos with hamburger meat. So, hamburger meat. Put this in the sink. That's not it on the nun food. See, my son put the deodorant in this bag. Got me some more of this Sure deodorant. I wasn't planning on getting this, but I wanted some roast beef. I saw it in the store, so I wanted it. And because I got some mashed potatoes, I needed milk. Because for me, I can't make mashed potatoes without milk. It's a must. And this chicken, it's already made. It's already cooked, but I recook it and season it. To make it how i want it to taste how i want it to taste so this is amazing if you want something quick this and then i got this chives mashed potatoes which i am gonna recook and re-season that's what i got the milk for and then i got two packs of these because y'all know i love these coca cola energy i got two of these and then because i have not had cashews in so long a big thing of salted cashews yes i love these all right so that is that hold on because I told y'all i'm making nachos i got some cheese but it's probably gonna go bad soon so i just got another big bag of the fiesta blend cheese shredded cheese and even though i don't have my son this week we walked right past it and he loves these so i had him get two of these ramen noodles the other back boxes over there because i'm gonna put some salsa in my taco meat i got some of this mild chunky and thick salsa 
Taco Bell brand. And even though I have one of these in the refrigerator that's almost empty because I used some last night. And then I have another one in the cabinet that's not open. I didn't want to run out. Another one of the Salsa Con Queso by Tostitos. I ran out of my boiled peanuts. I got four of these. These are so good if you've never had these. Yes. So I got four of those. Publix never, well, I haven't seen Publix have this one. The Ghirardelli sea salt caramel. They have like the regular kind, which that's good too, but I like this sea salt. It's my fave. So I got two of these so that I don't run out. And then gotta have the taco seasoning for my nachos. And then chicken gravy. I love this stuff. I put it in a lot of different things. And then I also got the roasted turkey one. And then I got, I wanted the orange vanilla, but they didn't have any. And these were the last two. I got two of these six pack of the cherry Coke bottles. The other one is over there. And then I saw these, I wasn't planning on getting these, but we were right there by them for Halloween. I love to get these different flavor ones, but these are for Halloween. The frosted sugar cookies and they're soft, which I don't eat hard cookies, but I was just like, why not get in the Halloween spirit? So got these. And then I went in the gas station cause my mom had to get some gas and I was happy that she did because I have been wanting some more of these David Ranch because um, they don't sell the David brand in Walmart. The only other place other than Dollar Tree, and I'm not going to no Dollar Tree. I don't even know where Dollar Tree is around here, but I know they sell them at gas stations. So I was like, oh yeah, she got to go get gas. I can go in there and get some. And it was the last bag. So yes. And then I've never even seen these. Actually, I have seen these in one other gas station. Y'all know I love these. I got three bags of, bags of them and I got another bag in uh, my pantry that's not open. Public sells them too, but the gas station right down the road, I got three bags of them. That's that and the last two things. I think I left them at my mom's house. When I was at my mom's house, I had a drawer that had two coffee mugs and this other bowl i think i left it at my mom's house because it's not here and i went through all of my boxes that i still have packed because i have boxes in the closet in the office that i've kept packed up i thought they were in one of those boxes and they're not and they're not in the stuff in my closet in my bedroom so i think i must have left them at my mom's house but i needed those mugs and they're not here so i just went ahead and bought me two coffee mugs this cheetah print one it's cute i wish it had a handle i don't understand coffee mugs without handles but and it has a lid but i'm probably not going to use it with the lid like as far as to drink because it'll never it might cool because it's ceramic but yeah how cute is it it's super cute i wish they had better stuff but surprisingly they didn't and walmart normally has a good variety of coffee mugs but they didn't this time and then i got like this goldish well like this rainbow pinkish one and it says boss babe on both sides i don't know if it's picking up the color but it's like a rainbow type color pink it's super cute and this one does have a handle so those are the last two things this was going to be included in the vlog that i started this morning but it's 24 minutes so this is just going to be a standalone vlog of it by itself i am gonna get this stuff put up i hope that you enjoyed this vlog i wasn't planning on this being a standalone vlog but 24 minutes it has to be a standalone vlog so i hope that you enjoyed this grocery haul like always don't forget to subscribe i'm gonna put away this madness and i will see you in my next one Bye.